10,540 pounds as built and equipped in this video. This is a Cougar 327 RES rear entertainment, couple slides here at Haylet RV of Coldwater, Michigan. And despite the fact that rear entertainment RVs have actually uh, dwindled in popularity in the last couple years, this one has continued to be uh, a bestseller. It's still one of Cougar's best selling floor plans. And the reason is they did it right. Rear entertainments are great floor plans, it's just that people haven't built and appointed them properly. They've cut corners and Cougar continues to build the best layout. Now, little smart details like this while we're on the outside, I love pointing out like the fact that they just have this extra little, it's, it's nothing, but just this extra little flap here so that you have a full pass-through cargo basement space with extra little like tool chest built in is great. Outside TV hookups in there, you can see all the aluminum skeleton. We've got the magnetic door latches to make life easy coming in and out. So, you know, when you're done with it, just flip it and forget it. Um, as opposed to set it and forget it. Thanks, Ron Popiel. But the, uh, uh, if, by the way, at any point, if you're kind of curious to know what this thing's running with its specific set of equipment, all you got to do is click the link in the video description that says check for price and availability. That will tell you exactly what we have in stock, exactly how it's built, and exactly how much we're asking for it. Also, you'll find things like tank capacities and links and all sorts of good stuff there. Um, Cougar uses a, uh, a max turn nose cap that allows for uh, better turns on short bed pickups. Or, uh, you know, it's you can always be 100% safe by just getting a proper sliding hitch, which we can offer you here because we do hitching, pieces, parts, financing, trades. Um, we can deliver this thing to your front door. We also have trucks for package deals. I mean, we could do anything you need, guys, and I don't care where you live. We make deals happen. And if at any point you find this video useful, all I ask is you pick up the phone and give us the opportunity to quote this out for you because you literally have nothing to lose but a lot of money. And think about it. That's true. Um, Cougar is and has been uh, tested uh, at 0 to 100 degrees for a number of years, so these things are going to continue to perform very well for you, even in uh, you know extended use seasonal situations. Things like your, your water hookups being enclosed, things like your um, gate valves being enclosed and uh, forced air heated. We've got a forced air heated insulated underbelly that also protects your uh, water lines so that your water lines are enclosed and heated, and once again, just drop it and you're done. Um, we have insulated slides, we have well insulated roof, again zero degree tested and successful with seal gripping, leak preventing slide walls over here so that you don't have to worry about your slide getting kind of crimped halfway in and out, um, so that you don't worry about water trickling down in there. And by the way, these have a, a, a gel coated skin, so we've got massive reflectivity and this thing looks great. That's also going to help with long term uh, weathering. Um, an extension of that is the fact that Keystone uses some of the highest grade decals in the business in today's market. Um, in the past, in like in 03 I'm talking, they didn't and it kind of stung them a little bit and they've since learned the error of their ways and now they have five year guaranteed decals on here. So they have, uh, that, that's what I like about Keystone, where they, they, they understand they're not perfect. Nobody's perfect, nobody. But they do the things that need to be done where they need to be done to get this thing in top shape and working order. Um, for instance, uh, you know we've got the Moride CRE 3000 um, suspension system here. It's a rubber compression equalization system to help absorb shocks and jolts from the road at ground level before it gets translated up into the RV. Um, I don't know if you noticed, you saw that travel rack on the back there for your extra cargo when you're going down the road. These are great because I don't I don't know if it's coming through the camera. We're actually getting drizzled on a little bit here right now. I'm using my other hand to kind of shield the camera as much as I can. Um, the uh, aluminum steps here aren't really going to be slippery when it's raining outside. They're going to grip your feet a little bit better that way. Uh, Cougar also uses a 30 inch uh, entry door here so that you can just walk straight into it. You don't have to do a little sideways shuffle to get in. Um, you know, fully walkable roof. Uh, the, I mean, if you want a good house, you have a good foundation, and that's why they use Dynaspan flooring. Each floor deck in this, upper deck and lower deck, is a one-piece seamless deck. Um, it actually has 50% greater strength than plywood. It's a really cool product. Uh, it comes in like 24-foot lengths, so it can cover additional floor space that 4x8 sheets of um, normal materials cannot cover. And remember that the decor that we have here may not, probably isn't the exact one that we have in stock. So... Again, uh, there, there's a lot of guys that build rear entertainments. What is it about this one that has maintained its best-in-class sales record? Because for 15 straight years, Cougar is the number one selling fifth wheel on the market by a ways. They're killing it, guys. They are absolutely killing it. Uh, my last video, I introduced it as killing it with Cougar because that's exactly what they're doing. Um, 
Well, come back to the kitchen in a minute. Let's dig into the living room here. And this is one of the reasons why this rear entertainment continues to dominate. Uh, because it has this L-shaped, very residential feeling napping couch. You can sit in the corner, you can kick your feet up if you want, and just have boardwalk and park place view of your entertainment system. But here's the other thing. They made the TV move so that it can face the recliners and it can face the sofa, it can face the kitchen, the dinette. There's literally nowhere in the living room you don't have a perfect view of this screen. And that's what's really cool about it. And that is where most rear entertainments fail because they flat mount the TV, which when I'm in a trailer with a customer looks impressive because we're standing in the middle of the coach looking at it. We're not sitting on the side trying to crane our neck around. You don't have to do that in here. Because these chairs can uh, swivel and kick a little bit, notice their recliners also, this is super comfortable. I mean, this is the angle I'm holding my neck at versus straight. Oh, actually, no, here's straight, and here's all I have to do. And, and I have a perfect view of the TV. It is not a neck crank TV whatsoever. Now, this is a couple's coach. If you want to kick it up another notch, recommendation I have is stow those two chairs, either at home or in your basement when you're traveling, in case you have guests slide the chairs over more, and then you can crank these things on an even greater angle and literally have 100% direct viewing of the, of the screen. Now, back to this. This is a hide -a bed uh, This section right here is a trifold memory foam sleeper sofa. This section right here is storage. If you lift those cushions up, you actually have storage there. We have all LED lights. I don't know if you noticed how all the lights came on with one switch in the main cabin, which is cool. And I also, by the way, I like that they made them look just like camper lights, but they're, they're cool modern LEDs. That's what I like about this. It still feels like a camper, but it's still got all the cool modern stuff you want, like the nice roll-down blackout window shades. If you want to blot out the sun, you can, and then, ta-da, it's like magic. Power outlets on both sides of the entertainment center for, I don't know, any appliance or extra thing like a Blu-ray player you want to bring along with you. Um, we've got dual opposing super slides, so this thing just has a Mondo living room. I haven't said the word Mondo since I watched Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles as a kid. Feels good to come back. Oh, by the way, electric space heating fireplace, so you don't have to burn up your propane to add a little extra heat to the RV. And listen, devil's in the details, that's the hardwood fascia test right there. A little wedding ring test will get you a long way in the RV business. The uh, freestanding table, again, this is a couple's coach, and that's why they, I love the big windows. A booth doesn't allow for that size windows here, so a, a freestanding table gives you big windows. Now, again, like I mentioned, most of the time you're probably just gonna need two chairs. But if you have guests, flip up that little leaf, use all four chairs, and you're camping, man. You're, you're good to go. This little entry, I don't know, credenza, little mini office station right here, I like that. Because it has a very at-home look and feel. And if you look real close in here, you see there's actual little phone charger outlets hidden there. Here, hold on. Let me shed a little more light on the situation. Ta-da! You can see that guy hiding away in there. Um... And, you know, this is a perfect place to just have extra little utility stuff, like you can have your grill lighters and all your little quick indoor-outdoor stuff right there. Um, the uh, kitchen uh, is part of this super slide. That chunk of the kitchen actually slides in and out. And the upper countertop telescopes over the uh, peninsula wraparound countertop. And there is 100% easy access to every square inch of everything below that countertop, by the way. Um, very cook centric, very person centric kitchen because you can, like if I get here a little closer, you can kind of see how everything sort of wraps around the cook a little bit. Everything's on just a little bit of an angle and a bias to be able to come to you. And this, this is the perfect appliance station back here. By the way, that is not a wallpaper. That's an actual backsplash board as well. Um, solid surface countertops allow for the uh, inclusion of an undermounted stainless sink and we have both high rise and sprayer extension faucet here. Some very nice stuff. Um, bonus drawers over here just for quick prep space. These are really good for like your big spatulas and, and your big prongs and forks and things. Uh, extra space and storage. Ever oh, that is smart. A lot of brands, they'll shove the oven all the way to the wall to make it look like, holy cow, huge counter space. And don't get me wrong, that's cool. But th it's nice to have an extra little bit of counter space on both sides of the oven so that you have extra places to set hot things when they come out. Eight cubic foot refrigerator freezer, and you can see that we have more kitchen storage going to town over here on both sides of that as well. Um, also, neat little touch right when you walk in the door. Coat closet, hot pocket. We've got a uh, Max Air fan up here with a wall controller so you don't have to be 10 foot tall to get to that thing. And by the way, your one-touch automatic leveling system, 
your power awning, your slide outs, your on, uh, awning lights, those are all touch screen remote control activated. You can get to all that right here. It's very simple and easy. Something they did really well here is they gave this a walk through dual access, well not walk through, but dual access bathroom. You can get to this from the bedroom, you can get to it from the hallway. We've got great like toilet paper storage here, extra tank tablets, all kinds, I mean shampoos, conditioners, everything in between. Porcelain foot flush stool and lots of leg room so you can actually stretch out in here and get comfortable. And we have a, what is this? This has got to be a, a 60 inch walk-in seamless molded shower with a nice skylight full walk-in height and it is a self-reinforced shower this thing is heavy duty if you've seen this couple of my videos you know what's coming keep in mind i'm standing right next to the drain and i ain't worried about it watch this this is a heavy duty shower guys these are heavy duty components made for real world use big people use a lot of rv showers have these little plastic shower pans and when you stand in them you can feel, uh, you can kind of feel like you're moonwalking, like they're sinking below your feet. You're not going to run into that with this Cougar because it has a higher grade component. It matters. It matters. Um, nice queen walk around bed. And this is a true queen, by the way, 80 inches long. So real queen residential sheets are going to fit that and see that we actually have walk around bed space here, which is nice. Um, full eight foot wide front wall to wall wardrobe closet. And you can throw a washer dryer in this section over here, or you can just have a ton of storage. Now this is the same big window that like they have in the big Montana fifth wheel bedrooms. They have that even here in a Cougar at less weight and cost. That ain't all bad either. Uh, the wall over here is prepped and ready for an extra TV. Sometimes we'll order that in, sometimes we won't. It also just depends on what they have available and how quick we can get it with great dresser space below as well. And once again, every room just has easy one switch lighting. So, ooh, I like that raised panel. Um, give us a call, 800-256-5196. Haylet RV of Coldwater, Michigan. Yeah, thank you very much. Take care, stay safe, have fun, and happy camping, everyone.